Hello friends, welcome to another unboxing video. This one's gonna be kind of fun. Um, I have this uh, epoxy uh, resin and hardener here. So this two parts thing. Unfortunately in a transit, the, the lid on this one completely snapped off. But I do have a container and I'm gonna put some dyes in here and try to make a pretty cool project out of this. Resin is really interesting. Um, this one's supposed to um, dry clear and super hard in just about, I think, 40 minutes work time, and it hardens in four hours and cures in like 24 hours. So I got a resin epoxy uh, leveling table also. So this is self-leveling, but I wanna make a cool little project out of that. And epoxy's always uh, been kind of an interesting thing, but it can be super expensive. It's coming down in uh, price now, so I'm kind of excited to try out a little project and see how it goes. So I'm gonna be uh, taking this out um, in the garage and showing you guys what I can come up with. Hello my friends, so the resin was, yeah, I poured it a lot thicker than recommended, but check that out. That is the end result here, and look at that, it's like clear, it's really uh, pretty. Um, if I had some coloring, I might actually get some more, this is so easy to work with, there's like no bubbles in here. Um, I, in that container, I was a little concerned that it might not come out because it's a plastic. I just kind of bent it like you would like um, oh, an ice cube tray and then it just kind of came right out. The ends are a little bit upturned, but I can just, uh, just sand that down. But I think it's a really cool looking piece here. It just looks like the ocean on the side there. It looks like water. Um, we got my beach here and the pebbles, but this resin is incredible. I mean, just look at that. There's like no, there was no bubbles at all. Even though I like poured it on here where the sand was and there was like air trap and there was coming out and it still, I uh, mix it up and everything, it wasn't bubbling. I'm just really impressed with this. I thought it'd be a lot harder to work with and it said it might yellow if I poured it thicker than a quarter of an inch, but I poured this, the whole thing, it's about an inch thick and no issues at all. You're supposed to do like different coats, but I was just like, hey, let's just check it out, see how it goes. And look at that, it's just like, it's like a, big old piece of glass or whatever. It's really cool. I might actually do some more stuff with this. I was a little intimidated at first because I thought it'd be difficult to work with, but even um, like putting a coating on your table or something, I might be doing that because I did it before on my table, but not with a resin uh, epoxy, but with a, it was kind of like a paint stuff and it took me forever. And this is basically, it's self leveling also. So you just pour it in there and that's the result, my friends. I'm super impressed with this stuff.